If your projects are similar to one another, you're probably used to using an old project and changing it to fit the requirements of the new project. This usually involves repeating manual operations over and over again, which is tedious and prone to potentially costly human errors. SkyCAD's configuration management solves these problems by allowing a single template project to cover all the configurations you need, without leaving you much work to do. With SkyCAD, you define configurations by adding options to a template project, and then apply modifications to that project in the context of those options. Then, when you use that template to start a new project, you simply have to activate whichever options are needed, and all those modifications will be applied automatically. To add an option to your project, select your project in the tree view, reach the Configuration Management tab, and click Add Option. You can then name it as you like, then make the desired modifications pertinent to that option. For example, we'll make this conveyor bidirectional, by moving some components around in the schematics and panel layout, adding some new components, and assigning part numbers to them. Deactivating an option brings the project back to the baseline, immediately undoing all the modifications that belong to the option. Activating the option again immediately brings back all the modifications pertinent to the option. No other update to the project is required. Options can be added to more than just projects too. Adding options to systems can be extremely effective and time-saving. Options can also be added to catalog part assemblies, so entire configurations of accessories can be added to a component by simply selecting the options. These were a few simple examples. In reality, Projects may be hundreds of sheets long, with harness design, wiring and cable lists, parts list, and more, and the project may have many options and sub-options in the options tree. For more information about how to use SkyCAD's configuration management, see the other tutorials under the Get Flying tutorial page.